there's a lot I could do at this red light. I could check my text, make plans for the night. I could tweet my thoughts, but answer my phone. But I'm gonna keep my eyes on the road. Oh, yes. Oh, I love that. It's a song about distracted driving. Yeah. Sounds like a lot of fun, but there's a serious reason behind that. Yeah, of course. There's a young man, Mitchell Kiefer, uh, uh, was on his way to Michigan State uh, a couple years ago, right? He was driving back September 2016 along I-96 mm -hmm. on his way back to state, and he was uh, rear-ended by a vehicle driven by a woman who was distracted on her phone. All right, so, so often. the Kiefer Foundation uh, was putting together a contest. Of uh, $25,000, right, uh, uh, for a, a song about distracted driving. And the winners of that are in our studio right now. We are so excited. Yes, it's Ariel, Zoe, and Eli, too. And, and the, what we really are excited about is is we all go way back. I mean, I, I wrote a couple songs you guys did on your kids' show the, a couple years ago. Yeah. Oh, couple, yeah. Ten years ago? How long ago? Yeah, they were, we're little. Like, we were, like, we were like, what, like 14 years old? And now <laughs> yeah. we're almost 20. So. Yes, exactly. <laughs> wow. You're, you're no longer kids. And I know my dad interviewed you guys when, when he was on the radio years he ago, too. He gave us too. our start. Yep. He did, well, thanks, Dad. How about that? <laughs> wow. <laughs> so I get credit for that. You get right? credit for giving them a start <laughs> there. Well, it is so wonderful to see you guys now. But so you wrote this song. Tell us a little bit more about what you did. Uh, yeah, so we heard about this uh, distracted driving contest. And uh, we thought, you know, we like to write songs about things that really inspire us mm -hmm. or really impact us things we find important we were actually we were sitting at chipotle one day, one day we were all thinking of <laughs> ideas and uh I, someone said like hey what, what if there was a puppet involved and we're like it's, it's got to be 30 seconds long we're like because <laughs> people listen to puppets you know like right. sesame street like kids also kids, kids listen to puppets kids will tell their parents hey you know keep your eyes on the road like right. everybody will be puppets teach important lessons they do. yeah <laughs> right <laughs> All right, so so the, the video actually has a puppet behind the wheel, which turned out to be your, your dad, Matthew, who is actually on the floor of the car yes. operating the puppet. Yes, <laughs> did a great job. A highly skilled job. Didn't say a word, which is kind of unusual. <laughs> exactly. <Yeah>. He's a talker. <laughs> <laughs> um, but anyway, so you guys sang the song. Eli is over here. Uh, and actually, you haven't said a word yet. You're not the talker. Hey, guys. <laughs> <laughs> so so you got $25,000. I mean, that's that's yeah. pretty amazing, too. So what are you guys going to do with that? Oh, um, man. <laughs> we're probably going to just put it towards the projects that we're working on. Zoe and I are both writing musicals at the moment, and I know Eli does a lot of music. Yeah, I make uh, a lot of electronic music, so I make a lot of the instrumentals for the songs they write and stuff and right. do a lot of original work myself. That's Wonderful. great. And you guys have been on a, a number of, you've had a, a number of your own shows over the years uh, oh, yeah. on syndicated TV, and you've uh, been quite successful for a bunch of young people. Thank you. Thank you. All right, we want to hear this. Can you yeah, you're going to play us? another oh, yes. original song for yeah. us. Oh, yeah. Um, this song is a song I wrote inspired by The Fault in Our Stars. And okay. it's called OK. All right. Hit it. Thank you so much for coming in this morning. Thanks for Thanks having us.